Hey guys, today's on uh, academic journals, academic journals, but uh, first, allow me in my prelude, my prelude to academic journals. This is my jib right here, for reasons of medical confidentiality. My name is Robert Francis, and this is my Unconquering Schizophrenia YouTube channel. Um, I'm a licensed clinical social worker. Um, I've been a mental health therapist for 15 years, and I've been diagnosed with schizophrenia for a quarter century. And if that don't gray your beard, I don't know what will. This is my uh, uh, Mikhail Bird um, Boston Celtic t-shirt, and this is the extent of my political leanings. If you don't know who they are, they're our teammates from 1986 when we won it all, Boston Celtics. Academic journals. There's about, guys, there's like 10 to 12 um, academic journals in the world dedica uh, dedicated to schizophrenia. Um, researchers around the world, usually at universities, usually PhDs and MDs, who conduct their research um, wherever they are. And when they have some findings, they will document their findings and submit them to the appropriate um, academic journal. And there's about 10 of them on schizophrenia. But I wanted you to know about one in particular. It's called the Schizophrenia Bulletin. The Schizophrenia Bulletin. And uh, it's probably the number one journal in the world. So I wanted you to know about it. If you Google it or Yahoo it, you will find the Schizophrenia Bulletin. If you go to that page, you will find um, research articles on schizophrenia. And you can see what they're up to, uh, the most uh, prominent people in the world, what kind of research they're doing on schizophrenia. They're always investigating our brains, guys. They're always investing our, our, our brains and our genes. Um, and that's what you'll find, and you'll find their professional findings. Um, some articles are available for, for everybody to read, not every other, uh, but not all articles. It's called the Schizophrenia Bulletin. It's the uh, most prominent uh, uh, journal on schizophrenia in the world, and there's probably some other ones. There's one that's called Schizophrenia Research. There's another one that's called Psychosis. There's another one that's called uh, something else. I don't remember, but the bulletin is the number one uh, journal. Now, here's one last interesting aspect of that is the Schizophrenia Bulletin will receive, they call them first-person accounts. A first-person account is someone who writes um, about their lived experience with schizophrenia. I wrote two articles for the Schizophrenia Bulletin, and they um, published both, and uh, it was pretty cool. I wrote about some delusions um, and uh, an episode and my first person ex experience, and they published it um, in the uh, journal. So if you ever want to write a page or two about your experiences with psychosis, perhaps if you send it into the Schizophrenia Bulletin, perhaps they will publish it. And that's pretty darn cool. And uh, if you have any questions about that particularly, just leave it in the comment section. I'll get back to you. So um, this is where the research is compiled in these different um, academic journals. And I just wanted you to know about that. All right. All right. That's it. I'm running over. See you next time.